I forget what's in this particular part of the temple. I think it's, uh... I think it's weapons or something. The armory? I don't know, it's just like a lounge. Joffrey, we got business to take care of. Excellent work. I knew I could count on you. The gods did not idly choose you as their agent, whatever you may think. But it is clear that Mankar Cameron will soon bring all his power to bear against Bruma. I will warn the Countess of the danger. You should speak to Martin. I believe he has made some progress with the Mysterium Xarxes. That's just great. I will send it's kind of weird though, because like we started talking to him, and he was like, "Oh, did you get the, uh, did you get the spies?" And then he, he said it all evil, like he's like, "Excellent work." It was a little creepy, Joffrey. I'm not gonna lie. All right, let's go have a chit chat session with Martin over here. I've deciphered part of the ritual needed to open a portal to Cameron's paradise. Xarxes mentions four items needed for the ritual, but so far I have only deciphered one of them. The blood of a Daedric Lord. In fact, Daedric artifacts are known to be formed from the essence of a Daedric Lord, from whence they derive their great power. Not an easy thing to come by, obviously, but we will need a Daedric artifact. Bring it to me when you have acquired one. Well, because I have two Daedric artifacts, and I don't want to give you either of them, one of them would be Umbra, and he's still talking, so I'm going to get out of here, because I don't want to listen to his ramblings anymore. Um, I, I don't want to give him either of the Daedric items that I have right now, so... I have no idea where any of the other Daedric shrines are at. The hell? Okay, so... I guess this is as good a time as any. We're going to go ahead and sleep and level up again. Back to level 22, and this is what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to start the Shivering Isles and probably work my way towards getting the armor that I want to get because by the time uh, I get the armor, I should be level 23. At least I am pretty sure I will be. So, uh, my reasoning behind this is that by the time we get to that point, we'll get the armor that I want to get, and then we'll come back to the main quest, and... I'll also be able to Google where a shrine is at, and then we can go to that shrine and get whatever item the uh, that Daedric shrine has to offer, and it'll probably be a poopy item, because I don't want to give Martin a good item, so... That's what we're going to do. Let's head over to the Shivering Isles right now. And the Strange Door, that's got to be it right there. We'll just travel to Bay Roan Stables and... See how it goes. We could just probably swim over there. I don't think there's like a bridge or anything, but nevertheless, it's gonna be a shitty swim. Swimming through the lake. It's all poopy and stuff. It's probably polluted, you know? There's probably like trolls pooping in it, like this guy on the loading screen right now. Trolls are kind of freaky when I like, you know, take a minute to look at them. They've got three eyes. What's up with that? Like, that's a triclops, maybe? Not a cyclops or not a regular two-wide clops. But a triclops, I don't know. And there's an oblivion gate right there, and I don't want to mess with that. Wait a minute. Is it gone? Oh snap, the gate is uh it's no longer there for some reason. That's weird. We didn't even get a chance to like go in it and do stuff. I guess they already shut it down or something. That's that's really weird. I've never seen that before. Because I have not closed any oblivion gates since the uh, first one that we closed. So maybe the NPCs were badass enough to close one on their own. I don't know. Maybe it's a glitch. But these spider people are really scary, so that's why I'm killing them. Wow, jerk. Can I light you on fire? Where's my fire spell? Knocking my ass on the ground. That's a little messed up, would you say? Light you on fire, fool. Now you're dead. Okay, so where am I going? We gotta go to the left, it seems. Can't see because of all this damn fog, man. Are we going? And it's like straight ahead from right here. Straight ahead from this rock. Yeah. I'll just swim out there and hopefully the little island over here will show up at some point. And if it doesn't, I'll be very, very sad faced. Come on. Where's the island? It should be showing up. Oh no. I see like mountains and stuff. Oh, there's the island. Alright, I can barely see the outline now. There we go, and I can see the door, too. This is like another door to Oblivion, technically speaking, but it's like a door to a different plane of Oblivion. It's not the scary, red-skied, terrifying Oblivion. It's the crazy, drugged-out part of Oblivion, so... I could be wrong on that. could be very well wrong on this whole uh, 
hypotheses I have, or this whole explanation I have, but I think I'm right. One. It's not right! Madness! Why? Why? Everything is wrong! It can't be done! Stay away from me! I won't go back. You can't make me go back! I'll kill you all! You're all going to die! Alright. Oh, he's gonna attack us? Okay. <laughs> I'd stay back from that door if I were you. Nothing that's gone in has come out right. Okay, a strange door. I don't know where it came from, and I don't want to. Those who've gone in have come back out wrong. I'm just here to warn folks to stay away. What happened to them? Look for yourself. Their brains are addled. Got no sense. Perfectly normal people went in there. And this is what's come out. That really sucks. I'm going in. Ha! It's your funeral. I'm just here to warn people, not keep them out. Go ahead in. I'll be here to clean up the mess when you come out. Pretty sure I'll be fine and I'm not gonna die, unworthy, but uh unworthy, unworthy, useless mortal meat, walking like a dumb. It's a little rude. Don't know who's talking right now, but I'm gonna a talk nice to this chick. Go. No, go away. I'm not here. Alright. So can we just go into the door now? What the hell? Open. Open sesame. Come on. Is there something I'm missing here? Bring me a champion. Rend the flesh of my foes. A mortal champion to wade through the entrails of my enemies. Okay. Can I go in now? The hell? Really? Do come in. It's lovely in the aisles right now. Perfect time for a visit. Oh, sweet. All right. Now the door is gonna let me in. This is very strange. I don't remember this part. I remember you have to like fight some kind of 20 foot tall dude. And he's kind of a pushover to be honest, but uh, who's this guy? He has some funny looking clothes on. Quaint. You look really sad. Sit. Oh, sit down? Don't mind if I do. Cool. Alright, now what? Do I talk to you? Yes, what can I do for you? I imagine you're here about the door. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yes, you have entered, and now you are here. Amazing. Truly. You should really cheer up, dude. You seem pretty sad. I am Haskell, Chamberlain to the Lord Sheogorath. Cool story, bro. You approach the Shivering Isles. Through the door behind me lies the realm of Sheogorath, Prince of Madness, Lord of the Never There. That's fantastic. Why did that door appear in Cyrodiil? Because my lord wills it to be so. It poses no danger to Mundus. No compact has been violated. It is a doorway, an invitation. Perhaps you will accept it for what it is. Who the hell is Mundus? They entered this realm and were ill-prepared. Their minds are now the property of my lord. How can they be cured? Cured? You speak as if they are diseased. They live now in another state of being. Perhaps it is you who needs a cure. Really? I think this guy's insane, but he's like quietly insane because... Well, I think you can tell for yourself. What do you want with me? For you? I do not know. My lord seeks a mortal to act as his champion. As for his intent, to attempt to fathom it is a foolish endeavor. His will is his own. His reality follows suit. You are here because you chose to enter. You were not summoned. That's a good point. What happens now? You do as you will. You may leave the way you entered. Your life will be none the worse for your time spent here. Or you may continue onward through the door behind me. If you can pass the gates of madness, perhaps the Lord Sheogorath will find a use for you. And if I go through the door? Who is to say? There are always choices to be made. The realm of madness is no different in that regard. Your choices are your own. Enter or do not, but make your decision. I have other duties to which I must attend. Speak with me again when you have made up your mind. The anticipation is almost too much to bear. Clearly, I can tell you're ecstatic with joy. Well, I want to steal this book because I can. And, um, why is there, like, a metronome here? The Narnia? 
Well, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed. When we come back, we'll keep talking to this guy in the funny clothes, probably go through the door, and uh, do whatever it is that we need to do in the Shivering Isles. I have not played this DLC in a while, so my memory's a little fuzzy on what happens, but when we come back, we'll go ahead and do all that. Love you guys, hope you enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Peace out.